YouTube. Man, what's good with y'all? You feel me? It's your boy, none of the soul, none of the chosen one, none of the glow. You feel what I'm saying? Man, I'm back with another video. I'm back with another banger. If you're rocking with my content, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. I just got out the gym not too long ago. You feel me? Still got the sweat on me and everything. You feel me? Man, I'm feeling blessed. I surpassed two weeks of retaining my life force. I surpassed two weeks of retaining. So I'm pretty sure I'm on day 17, day 18. You know, I surpassed it. And I'm very blessed to surpass it. You know, most people, most men, you know, even women, I don't, you know, I think y'all don't understand that. Also, women struggle with pornography. You know, like 30% of them struggle with pornography. They struggle with, you know, all the things they be using, the dildos, shower heads. You know, it's just all vain, vanity, bro. It's all disgusting. You know, but females struggle with this too. They may not be, you know, so out outwardly saying it like men, but they still struggle with it, you know? But most people can't even last, you know, they can't go celibate. They can't refrain themselves into indulging into pleasure for, for less than a week. They can't do it. They're going to fall into it, you know, because of society. People think when they get an urge, when they get, you know, that 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 urge to do something, they, they have to fap. They have to use a shower head. They have to use dildos, you know? Some of these dudes be going as far as using... I don't even want to say the word because my video might get taken down. But some of the men be using items as well. These, uh, these, uh, what is it? I don't even know what it's called. But I know what it's called, but I don't want to say it. <laughs> I don't want the video to get taken down. This is a banger, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's something that they call, it's a P, PP. I'm going to say PP. And if you know what that means, you know what that means. If you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. You know? Some men be using that as well. It's very disgusting. Is, is nasty just to even think about using things like that you know there's something really wrong with you you know this is why i make these videos for people to understand that retention refraining yourself abstaining is something that can benefit your life this is something that can elevate your life in all aspects you know you won't even see things the same when you start to practice retention man i'm about to talk about it bro i've surpassed two weeks how i'm feeling what i've experienced and what you will probably experience as well you know, the first thing I can really say, my confidence, bro. Oh, my gosh. My confidence has gone from, you know, uh, I was just, you know, I had a little bit of confidence, you know, and now I'm pumping weights. I'm hitting the gym. I'm getting my body in shape. I'm getting finances. I'm connecting to God even different now. You know, it, it's, it's, it's doing something to my confidence, bro. It's making me feel like a man, bro. You know, when you retain, you feel like a man. When you are relapsing all the time, bro, you feel weak. That's not how men are supposed to feel. We're supposed to be feeling aggressive. We're supposed to be feeling masculine. We're supposed to be feeling, you know, because we feel with that, with, with that testosterone. We're supposed to be walking like we that dude. And when you retain, you walk like you that dude. You're just that guy. You know, I, I said this multiple times. When you are retaining, you are just that guy all the time. You don't even, it's not cockiness. It's just confidence, bro. It's natural, you know? Look how calm, cool, and collected I am making this video right now. Do I seem nervous to you? Do I seem like I have anxiety to you? Do I seem like, you know, I, I'm shaking, I'm nervous. Like, I don't have that type of vibe on me right now. You feel positive energy coming through the screen. You feel confident. You feel positive. My mind is finally clear. I can look at women. If I don't want to talk, I'm not going to talk. If I want to, then I open my mouth and speak. <laughs> I'm just so calm, bro. This is something you will experience two weeks plus. You're going to be calm, cool, collected, like men should be when they see somebody approaching them. When they, you know, when, when especially women, you know, most of us used to struggle with that. Even myself, I used to struggle with just being around a female's presence and being nervous, being anxious. She wasn't even probably talking to me, but I was just so anxious, even though I was in her presence. You feel what I'm saying? Fellas, man, it's not worth it to bust nuts. Look at, look, look at, look at my skin. Look, just look at me right now. Look at me. Your skin will also clear up on two weeks plus if you've been eating the right food. You know, I've been eating super clean. I've been trying my best. Not, okay. I won't say super clean. That's a lie. You know, God forgive me. I just lied. I don't eat super clean, but I make sure I don't eat BS. You know, I, I don't eat snacks. I don't drink poison. That soda, soda is poison. If you drink drinking soda, cut that out. 
you know, but I don't drink none of that. What I mainly drink, you already know the deal, water. I just got out the gym. You feel me? Plan is finished. That's that's normally what I drink, or 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 some Gatorade. I ain't gonna lie. I be drinking. I be drinking that zero, the zero Gatorade or whatever. Y'all might say it's bad, but it is what it is. It's better than drinking soda. It's better than drinking that poison. It is, bro. Y'all need to eat clean on this journey, bro. Or else you're not gonna feel the full effects. You're not gonna feel as good. Your skin is gonna be looking all rough, and and you're gonna have acne. Make sure y'all transmuting your energy. Make sure y'all getting into the word of God. Make sure you're praying. This is the best journey I have ever, you know, got on, bro. This is the best practice I've ever practiced in my life. And you think I I'm just going to let this go? You think because uh, just a female is giving me choosing signals, I'm just going to let my seed go? Fellas, man, you got to be smarter than that. Just because a female likes you and she's giving you choosing signals doesn't mean you have to act on that, bro. You can lay back and do you. You don't have to pursue women that you just are focused if you're focused you shouldn't pursue women fellas you're focused why would you want to use that as an a distract as a distraction you know when it comes to that women are a distraction if you are trying to go somewhere in life as a man and you are chasing women you're trying to pursue her bro it's a waste of time you're not going to get to your dreams you're not going to get to your goals man i've learned this on this journey bro that i need to focus right now if I truly say I want what I want, I need to focus and I can't get no distractions in my way. If distractions come my way, I need to cut them off. This is how you must think on SR, bro, or else you will not accomplish what you say you will accomplish. You won't. You're going to have all these distractions in your way. Cut off all distractions. I've learned this on also my two week journey. You need to cut off people who are distracting you. I don't care if it's a woman. I don't care if it's a man. You need to cut them off. I don't care if it's family, cousins, brothers, sisters, mother, dad. You need to cut them off, bro. If, they, if they're holding you back, you need to cut them off. Love them from a distance. You can still love them, but love them from a distance. You need to move away. No cap, bro. I've learned so much, man. My, my, uh, my drive has also increased. My willpower has increased. Like waking up to, to, to the gym this morning in the mornings is not a hustle. It's not something I find difficult to go to the gym in the morning because I'm, 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 I'm driven and I have the willpower to do so. God is good, man. You know, I have eternal life. Like I have the ability to wake up and use all my body parts. Be grateful. You can use all your body parts. People out here, they can't, they, they don't have arms. They don't got legs, but you have the ability to hit the gym every single day. If you do hit it every day, whenever you hit the gym, just be grateful because, bro, you have the ability to use your body parts. That's a blessing. That's a blessing, bro. You have ability to go to the gym and get your body in shape, man. I'm, I'm grateful for that. You know, I wake up in the morning on this retention journey, praising God, first of all, and then I have no struggle going to the gym. I have no struggle trying to do what I have to accomplish throughout the day. I have no struggle doing that no more. All what the internet and Google is telling you that, you know, releasing every day consistently is good for you and you're not going to get prostate cancer, bro. You need to stop listening to that, bro. Like, like, like they are leading you astray. They are not putting you in the right direction. Google is cap. What they, if they, they don't talk about retention on Google. They say, oh, there's no scientific studies. What about the spiritual uh, aspects? Why are they not talking about that? Why do they keep doing, saying science? We don't care about science. I, me, me personally, I look at this more spiritual than science, bro. That science stuff is man-made, bro. Spiritual, that, that's the most high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See where I'm trying to go with this? You're gonna learn so much, man. You're gonna learn so much. The wisdom that you will encounter on on uh, SR, bro. You're gonna become a smart, intelligent man, man. You are. You might even get smarter. I've heard that. I've heard a lot of people say they got smarter on this journey. It's because you don't have more, no more brain fog. You're not filling your mind with filth and pornography and these lustful websites. You know, you're not just thinking about smashing women. No, you want something for yourself as a man, man. You do when you're on retention. You want to level up. You're not thinking about these women. You're just not. It's not to be an a-hole. It's not to be a man who just doesn't respect women. Nah, none of that. We, I love women. I respect women. It's just... As a man, you have to know when it's time for you to focus up and grind up. <laughs> that, that's what it comes down to. You have to know when it's time to cut off all distractions. Or else you're not going to make it 
to where you want to make it to. I would have not had all of these, you know, supporters. I would have not had it made wherever I am right now. I would have not made it this far if I did not cut off all distractions. If God didn't limit these people who were coming around me. All of that had to happen for me to get where I'm at today. Retention is worth it, fellas. Try this out. Seven to 14 days, man. If it, if, if it works, stay on the practice. If you seeing something happen to you, stay on the journey. Do not relapse. But if it doesn't work, if, if supposedly it doesn't work for you, you can go ahead and stop. Simple. You know, I don't want to force things onto y'all, but I want y'all to realize, just look at my growth. You know, some of y'all just watch my videos and it's like, you, 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 you just like, you're not looking at the bigger picture I'm trying to give you. You just watching me for, you know, you probably just not even paying attention. Watch the video and look at the message I'm trying to give to you. <laughs> like, yes, look at the message I'm trying to portray to you, bro. Look at the changes I am going through. Look at me. Look at my first video. Go back to my channel. I have these videos on my channel for a reason. Go back and look at who Nana used to be and look at me now. Man, are you trying to tell me this don't work? You know, I'm losing, I'm losing fat. I'm, bro, I'm losing a lot of fat. Like this journey, man, it's, it's something that happens to you as well. You lose a lot of fat on retention, especially if you hit in the gym, bro, your, your, uh, what is it? What they call it? Your body fat is going, it's going to go, it's going to go down. Shout out to the subscriber who told me that. Now he was like, yo, Nana, I've noticed you losing body fat, bro. Some people who, who meet me in real life, they'd be saying the same thing. They'd be like, yo, Nana, you look different in real life because you, you lost all that weight. It's crazy, bro. People who see me, who used to uh, hang around me when I was I was bigger, they be like, "Yo, Nana, you lost mad weight, dog. What did you do? What did you do? You know, my uncles, aunties, <laughs> the African uncles, aunties. They come they come to my house. They be like, "Yo, what happened to her? so so so? He lost so much weight. What did he do? <laughs> I was in that gym. I was retaining, praising God, man, drinking all this water." <laughs> man, I was peeing five, six, eight times a day. I, it was crazy because I was drinking so much water, bro. This is what I'm trying to let y'all know, man. You know, this is my two week plus update. The confidence is up. You know, the mind, the mental clarity is up. The mind is more free. The mind is clear. You know, you're not filling your mind with pornography and all these filthy things that, you know, the world wants us to look at. You're not looking at that no more. So your mind is more clear. You have mental clarity to think. Your brain is not fogged up with filth. My energy's up. I wake up in the morning with no hesitation to try to hit the gym. My willpower is up. My skin glow is up. You feel me? My skin is clearing up. My hair is growing thicker, blacker. You know, my eyes are becoming more vibrant. I'm having like a more structured masculine face, masculine posture. I, I, I stand up straight. I walk up straight. I don't, I don't walk slouched. I don't walk with my head down. Oh, hi. You feel me? Fellas, if you're doing that, you need to stop doing that. You're talking to somebody and you, you, you looking down. My brother, stop. You look unconfident. You know, you, you, you're not securing yourself, man. You don't value yourself. This is why you're unconfident. You're not respecting yourself because you're watching the hub. You're losing all that confidence. You, you just releasing it, man. Man, bro, when 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 will some of y'all fellas learn, bro? That is, it's just time in your life you need to grind. It's just time for you to put off all distractions, bro. You know, uh, the female attraction. That's that's last. You know, I, I don't care about it. You know, it's just it, it comes with retention. The female attraction is there. You know, women get nervous around me. Uh, I, I'm gonna give y'all a quick story. You know, yesterday I went to Smoothie King. Some of y'all was like, Nah, nah, stop going there. I was like, Bro. Their smoothies is pretty fire. I like some of their food over there. You know, I said food. The smoothies that they have over there, I like some of that. So I be getting it, you know, when I go there. I went there yesterday. I went to the, I pulled up to the drive-thru. And bro, this female off the bat, you know, I ain't gonna lie. She looked good physically. You know, physically I seen her face. You know, she had her hair done, nails done. You know, the typical, the typical, you know, modern woman. She looked good. I'm not even going to sit there and lie. But, you know, me personally, that's not my cup of tea. <laughs> you know, I don't rock with modern women. I just don't, bro. Because I know what type of spirit they carry, the Jezebel. So, you know, I mean, I didn't know what type of female she was. I was just looking at her appearance, um, you know. But when we were talking, you know, she was asking me for my order and all that. She was mad nervous. 
You feel me? And I, I, I think I, I said something, but I didn't really mean what I said. And she started laughing. <laughs> I, I think I was so close to like the drive through. I was so close to like uh, the wall. You see when you pull up to a drive through, I was too close to the wall. And then she was started laughing. I, I said it. I was like, oh, yo, I'm so close to the wall. She started laughing. It's not even that funny. I just said I'm close to the wall. Why are you laughing? <laughs> she started cheesing and she's fixing her hair. I'm like, yo, that's tough. Attraction is real, you know? But I don't retain to attract women. I, I retain to become the best man. I retain to attain. I retain to gain. Mm. If you with me, like the video. If you retain it to gain, if you retain to attain, achieve success, like the video, man. You know, God is good, bro. We are we have been put in this position for a reason. But that's what happened to me yesterday, man. You know, this female attraction, quick, quick attraction story. You know, you're gonna realize females will get nervous around you. You know, they're gonna just start laughing. Your charisma is through the roof. You don't you don't even try to be funny, it's just natural. These women, they, they can feel that you are confident, they can feel that you're not thirsty. You feel me? For them. And in turn, that makes you attractive. That makes anybody attractive. If you're not giving people attention, they're going to wonder why you're not giving them attention. They're going to come around you. They're going to want to talk to you. They're going to want to look at you in the eyes. This is what's going to happen with these women. Bro, on retention, this is real. You know, you y'all already know my channel. I don't I don't tell y'all to retain to attract women. You know, that's up to you. That's your choice. I can, I'm not forcing you to do nothing. I don't talk about that because that's not what I'm doing. I don't retain to attract women, but it comes with the journey. It comes with leveling up as a man. We women will love you. They will. You feel me? Love you as in obviously, you know, your energy, your presence, you know, your spirit. You're just pure. But the way you feel me, you see how when women uh, see babies, when they see little babies, <laughs> bro, they literally, they, they, they love babies. They're like, oh, he's so cute. <laughs> when you retain, you got that same vibe because you're pure again, man. You're retaining the life force. Babies are retaining, you know, they retain it. They look, they look so animated. When you look at a baby, the baby looks animated. This is how you look, bro. You look animated on retention. You probably been getting that. People are like, oh, yo, you look good. You know, your skin. I like your skin. You glowing. <laughs> Man, this journey is real. My muscle gains has been coming in too. Retain, fellas. This is worth it. But this is my two-week plus update. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I hope this gave you some type of inspiration to keep going, you know, because I'm never going to stop documenting my journey, whether people hit on me or not. You know, I just who I'm who I am. I'm here to bring the light into this world. I'm here to let y'all know that, hey, retaining is something every man should be doing. I don't, I don't want to hear it. Every man should do this because it's going to help your life change. Trust me, bro. I've been doing this on and off for two years. I know what this can do for you as a man. I know it. You know, I've been attracting things, too, as well. Opportunities, people, you know, just expect that. Expect that on this journey. But I love y'all, bro. Drop a like if you rocking with the content. Follow my IG at Nanado So. Join my Discord. Everything else you need is in the description. Salute to all the kings retaining, all the queens going celibate. Praise God, and I'm out.